Tens of thousands of Jews from around the world are in Queens to observe the anniversary of Rabbi Menachem Mendel Schneerson's death. Chopper 2, live over the cemetery in Cambria Heights. Right now you can see long lines remain as people are gathered to pray and show their respects. CBS 2's Steve Langford has more. Tens of thousands lined up in the intense heat for a few moments of prayer at the burial site of the man simply known as the Rebbe, Rabbi Menachem Mendel Schneerson. 20 years after his passing, a rare look inside as the anniversary draws pilgrims from around the world. Beryl Pusner is the rabbi in the Cayman Islands. This is a very, very uh, important uh, event, not only for me personally, for the entire Chabad movement and the entire Jewish world at large. The lines stretching out to and along Francis Lewis Boulevard. Families here with their young children. The occasion rarely observed up close, revealing the emotional moment when personal printed prayers are read before the gravestone of the man some call the most influential rabbi in modern history. The paper then tossed into a huge container before the Rebbe's headstone. The Jewish tradition teaches that the day of a righteous person's passing is an auspicious day. It's an auspicious day for our prayers to be answered. When Rabbi Schneerson died 20 years ago, his passing drew great crowds and sparked great emotion in the streets of Brooklyn. A generation later, the Rebbe may be more influential today. A recent biography of the Rebbe became a New York Times bestseller this spring. Those here to honor the Rebbe's memory speak of the example he set. Just because he was on judgment, he never judged people. He taught his students to love other Jews in any way or form, color or no color. The living, breathing testament to the powerful memory of a historic figure. In the Cambria Heights section of Queens, Steve Langford, CBS 2 News.